telling you right now, people are shocked because what they planned or intended has failed, but not only failed, right? It went back to them times 10. What's up, YouTube? I'm creating right now. You're checking out Eatles, everything on the other side. And look, I'm telling you right now, this is like the biggest thing that you really are not aware of in this moment. So big things are changing for you. That's why I said pay attention to your dreams. Pay attention to synchronicities. Pay attention to who's trying to come back. All of these things you got to be paying attention to. Real quick, before we do this video, it's best to do a breathing meditation. This is going to relax and allow us to just let go of anything and pick up the best video downloads that we can pick up right now. I'm talking about pure source information that people, the ones uh, who mess with this channel, who heavily, really, really mess with this channel, really need to hear it at this moment. So get ready, all right? Let's go. So let's go. We're going to do a quick three breath just to get us ready, relax, flush out anything that's holding, that's still holding on to us right now. And then we're going to do 27 breaths. This is going to amplify our energetic field and flush out any toxins right now. So get ready. This is going to be a powerful breathing meditation. 27 aka equals 9. 9 is completion. Today I saw a bunch of 9, which is why we're doing these breathing meditations much more frequently. So get ready. Congratulations, I'm telling you, this actually clears out your airways, respiratory, flushes out toxins, clear through any type of emotional distress. I'm talking about stagnation, depression, anything like that. All you have to do is fully ingest in, fully exist, uh, ingest out, but you don't always have to let everything out. Only let like 30% out, just enough to where you can hold on and just slowly release. Like over two minutes, three minutes. This will allow your body to open up its airways. It just makes you feel better, more energy. You'll just feel much better than if you were to just let it all out at one time. Sometimes it's okay to do that, but then it's sometimes you want to just practice retention. So holding it in. Same thing with semen retention. See, there you go again. You don't want to drain yourself. That's the thing. The more you drain yourself, the more depleted you are. And then breathing actually, it it like it replenishes you. So that's why breathing is important. So if you utilize this like, like semen a lot, if you're releasing and busting, then you should be breathing and doing these meditations much more. You got to counterbalance it. You can't just release and then not take in or practice breathing guided meditation. You just can't do that. That's going to cause a lot of ailments, a lot of ailments. So much so I can't even say so much. Put it like this. Go to your doctor if you want to... Uh, put a, 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 a bit. Never mind. So, anywho, 
today's video, I ain't gonna touch the topic on that because we got a bunch to talk about right now. So right now, you are the topic of discussion. Do you know why? Because you overcame all obstacles. Hell, even today it was a tax. If you have to go somewhere and cars will park and won't do nothing but stare, you are a victim of gang stalking. Simple. That means people are watching you. They're heavily fixated on you. People, they're even probably trying to siphon something from you by pushing on their own projections. People utilize that to siphon, but it comes with it comes at a cost because if you don't realize what this person has around them, what kind of protection or who they are, then you actually you end up you end up having to come times ten. You don't want to do that. You saw the craft. It came times 10 to them. It came times 10. Do you know why? Because they're messing with the wrong mother. Watch the craft. Nigga is, man, it makes no sense. Now people are realizing that they should not have even messed with you because there's always an overseer. God, you know, okay, first of all, God doesn't need an excuse or explanation for creating all that is because the embodiment of God is creation itself. So the point of God is to create. So if you're going against the embodiment of God, what do you think is going to happen? Like, come on. This is this is beyond crazy. That's why I say cats, you never know. That's why you don't want to just willy nilly, especially if you're not like, if you're not that, if you haven't cleared through much emotional karmic debt, then do not do nothing, which means don't try to put out some bad vibe towards people that you don't know. Because guess what? You can't put anything on anybody else. You actually put it on yourself because it's, it's a mirror of self. So people actually hurt themselves. Only themselves. Nobody else. That's why I said. When you stay in your purity and don't mainly agnostic. Because if you notice your purity, they're not heavily fixated on something. The children, seven, eight years old, they're not trying to exactly. What is that? Purity. You know why? Because... They're not giving it to something else because they know it's, and there you go. It says for itself, it speaks for itself. Just like scientists never create nothing. They study creation itself to understand the universe to be able to manipulate it. It's a, uh, I'm telling you, everything is there. So basically they study you to try to manipulate it and realizing that they don't, they don't know you. This is why they're shocked because they thought they knew you, but they don't. And now you're making people look because you are doing your own thing. You yeah, yeah, you're feeling the effects of or you're feeling the picking up the vibes of it, the energy, the the signature, the energy signature in the air. There's energy signature that gets let off when people put out a certain or have a vibe or have a certain intent. Yes, it's all energy, everything's vibration. So you pick up the energy signature, but you're not focused on it. You don't give a shit about it because you understand it's not benefiting you and that the devil always shows up when you are always about to seek or wreak greatness. Every single time. So you already know this, which is nothing new because everybody should know this. Everybody, whenever you go through a whole new, uh, get ready for a whole new shit, a lot of bad shit, but you realize that people are actually, people are actually the karma themselves that they see. Because now what they did, they got to, it mirrors and then now they got to see people and everything against, everything opposite. That's what's going on right now. I did a video on Mercury Retrograde. It's opposite world. That means if you put out something bad for them, you actually putting it, you mirroring in yourself. God, God puts you right in that place. That's what it's like. That's why people don't like the Mercury retrograde because everything, because this is the only, only time when, when you could be negative and it benefits the world. The only time. Any other time you be negative, it's not gonna benefit you at all. That's why we was telling people like, if you don't know anything about yourself, first of all, masters never do anything to harm or show ill intent because the more you know the more it can come back, will come back if you're utilizing it towards a bad game. So trying to hurt other people with malice, uh, malicious intent in your heart, the more you information you have, right, right? The more full you are, the more God will protect you, aka the more you're in your child side, the more you're connected to source protection. But the moment you're operating from like <laughs> uh, malevolent, con uh, conniving, like you go off and write like, Say for example, these people are go off and learn things and acquire information only to hurt people. That is when God do not protect. Because you're you're seeking out information, you're trying to gain an upper hand to try to utilize it in a bad way. And they do. 
which is why they're noticing that nothing worked because anything that they tried to use in a bad way only got flipped and now they're seeing the repercussions and the outcome of that thinking you did but no you're just chilling that's i'm just picking up this yo i'm telling you right now it's it's, it's hilarious i know but if you resonate with the video you know what i'm talking about because we did a breathing guided meditation and this video is about something else i was about to talk about something way different and it's, for some reason this, this information just popped up in my brain. It's like, nah, we need to talk about this right now because you got to be healing stuff right now in order to ascend to the new stuff. So right now, if you're not experiencing any type of like shadow, which is why we're in a, we just exited the shadow period. So if you're experiencing shadow, it's because you're experiencing a Mercury retrograde, which is the effects of pre-shadow, which is why it ends on the 14th, but it don't really end until the first week of June. So you're going to be seeing the effects of that now. If you watch this video, congratulations. This video is for you. Also, if you've been showing support, you're only actually helping me so that way I can give you guys better information. That way we can all utilize information and rise together. For those who just want to elevate, thank you guys for your donations and your support. For those who just coming and signing information, thank you too. Yo, I'm just saying, whatever you gain, yo, congratulations, yo. New information will be uploaded to a website with a private server. That way you would need a code and you would have to be invited into the group. So you would have to get that information from YouTube. So I would have to see that you're a frequent person. So that way I can release that information to you so you can come and sign up for the website, aka private server, which I'm going to be giving you all the information that and other people like Spiritual Soul. I'm talking Von Tu Cut, uh, Foster eBay before. I'm talking about all the real people who was like, yeah, I'm about to be talking about all that. So, all right, y'all, yo, so good looking, y'all. Thank you guys so much, yo. Y'all be up, yo. Everything, all love, vibes, yo. Until next time, I'm Chris, and this is Everything on the Other Side. I'm signing out.